Good day everybody, this is uh, Open Challenge 3, it is uh, episode number 8 if I'm correct. And we are at turn 120, and we're about to have a battle at Chrislon. Chrislon 3, to uh, end the lives of the Silicoids once and for all. But before that happens, I would like to have this uh, small fleet join up uh, at Chrislon, so they are two turns away. And hopefully in that same time we can uh, attack the Iron Drive, so that will help us in combat as well. Um, okay, and we have a scout underway to a merchant colony. We have one battleship sitting here in the north. We are actually at war with the Trilarian as well. They have five uh, systems here. see some Burati ships going about, we're sitting here with our scout. We have the Tachyon scanner. Am I correct? Yeah, we have the Tachyon scanner, so we can have a better view of what's going on around us in the galaxy. We're uh, plus six for food, so we need to take care of that first. Battleships, I like to postpone that for one turn. Like so. Okay, let's check the silicoids. They still only have titanium armor and the class 1 shield. But they don't have much uh, or many new technologies at the moment. Holo Simulator. I like to have that actually. Fighter Garrison. Microbiotics is nice. Tachyon Communications would be really nice. It increases the command points of each base by one. So I'm going to attempt to steal some text from these guys before, uh, before they meet their end. So I will have 19 spies against them. They have no active spies against me. The Russian have 8 spies against me. The Trilarian have nothing. Oh, they have supercomputer. Atmospheric Renewer. Also Holo Simulator there. Battle Station. I like Battle Station always. Not a very useful tech in the end, but it's you know it's very cool to upgrade your base. A positronic computer. So they have positronic computer, and their best weapon is neutron blaster still. Okay, no, I'll, I'll keep it like this because I still want to try that silicoid. So to steal something from them. Uh, okay, turn 120. Let's continue. Select combat at Chrislon, so now I'm gonna cancel that. They have two battleships and a destroyer. Planetary stock exchange! Oh, from the Trilarian. Well, we only had one spy there. Increases revenues earned on a planet by 100%. And the Holo Simulator! <laughs> Stolen from the silicoids. Increases planet's morale by 20%. Oh, and we meet the Cylon as well. Okay, well this is a busy turn actually. I greet you on behalf of the Cylon Empire Mighty Sec. May our people live together in harmony. One or three finished star base. Okay, so you can start right away with uh, all the simulator and stock exchange, and then a battleship. So now I want to insert holo simulator on all these planets. Uh, all 
maps on the ones where star bases are built, I guess. But the stock exchange, I want to have it after the star base. Okay, so let's uh, adjust our build queue. Here's our build queue. So we have stock exchange. So that's going to happen after star base. And then the hollow simulator here. It's going to happen before star base. Okay. So this is our build view. Huh? I've minimized our build view to this uh, just these couple of buildings. All this stuff here doesn't uh, it's not taken into account because there's a stop command right here. Save. Eye on food. So now we press Q. We get all these hollow simulators. Except for this place where the star base was built. Okay, so turn one twenty one. Uh, let's continue. Breakthrough. So we should get the iron drive. So attack. This guy has uh, Commander Hawk. He gives us uh, plus ten in defense for all ships in the fleet. This is a runner with no leader, so we move forward. This is the runner with the uh, Sparky, Cyber out. He repairs our ships by 3% per combat round. This is also a runner. These are the bombers, let's hope they'll make it to the planet. The planet, by the way, has, uh, if you remember, a radiation shield, so six damage is blocked. And that means that nuclear missiles and mass drivers are uh, not doing any damage uh, to the ground defenses of this world. So that's why we had built the bombers in previous episode, but it didn't really work with these small vessels. And all the bombers got uh, targeted by the planet, so I had to retreat. So now I'm here again with uh, vessels that have Merculite missiles, so they can penetrate this uh, shield uh, defenses. That's the story. Here are the Merculite missiles. We we'll shoot it at the planet. Here's another guy. So we've shot 12 missiles now at the planet. Here's a ship with interceptors. So that's 24 missiles at the planet. So it's 24 times 6 and eh? not times 12. And we need 200 damage. So we're not there yet. This guy also has interceptors, but I'm gonna save them for a bit. Here's a big bunch of uh, Merculites. If I make this shot to the planet, that should be more than uh, sufficient, actually. Shoot them all.
I'm going to hold these interceptors in case uh, weird explosions happen. Like that, for example. Holy shit! <laughs> in the middle of my own rocket. Okay, not good. Very tricky that new defensive fire system of the patch. So runner ships are uh, under severe threat when they attack. It, wasn't lo it was not like that in the 1.4 version. Okay, so I'm not sure, uh, Thunder 4. Let's send this batch of missiles to him as well. And this one. And this one as well. Bombers are still uh, not being attacked by the planet. That's probably because AI thinks that Merculite missiles are a bigger threat than the bombers, which is probably right. Uh, so, okay, so we lost one missile here, I guess. And we lost one missile there also. Okay, so we didn't lose too many missiles, I think, but I'm gonna shoot this at the planet after all because I'm not sure if I'm counting correctly. Um, where are we now? Here we are. C for center. This guy needs to retreat. This guy is gonna hold his missiles in case anything goes wrong. This guy is gonna hold his missiles as well. This guy still has his interceptors. Still gonna keep half of them uh, in the ship. I usually do. I usually don't do this actually to keep the interceptors. I just shoot normally everything at the first turn. But in this case, with the three battleships, they might have these heavy explosions, and then everything is gone. So I'm gonna play it safe here. Now this guy has a lot of missiles on board. Shoot five at the planet, eight at the star base, and send the batch there, and the rest will wait.
Okay, so I have to make the choice if I will retreat, fire and retreat, or stay one turn. I guess I'm gonna fire and retreat. Fusion Beam and Merculite destroyed. Um, so. Okay, so we, de we destroyed a regular beam. Four became three. This guy can retreat. This guy can hopefully take down some missile. Nope, miss. We get another shot. Yes! One down. One more. Oui. This guy is in trouble. Never gonna survive that uh, volley of eight missiles. So let's move him here. One battleship down and a big explosion again. So did we are these our own interceptors? No, these are our interceptors. So let's shoot two of these at the star base and one at the planet. Okay, the planet is gone. Now the starbase is all that is left. We destroyed the ECM jammer. Nice. Very nice. And we have a lot of missiles inbound here. So good. Oh! Oi, oi, oi. 11 missiles left. So not too big damage. Well, the bomber is uh, here, but it's kind of useless now. You see how useless bombs are? Damn, we, we even arrived too late at the planet. You need really fast ships before bombs become useful. Otherwise, it's just not helpful at all. So, destruction! Okay, so you can shoot your rockets now. And 
retreat. These are our own guys, aren't they? Yeah, these are ours. Pretty hard to see. I hope I'm correct actually here. Yeah? Target carrier one. No, these are my color now. Twelve murky lights. Yeah, you can see here. These are the these are the brown ones. That one, the one, the one that is left here. Five interceptors. Now there's none. Yes, got it. Space Academy. That's it. That's all we get. A disappointment actually. Silicoid Empire Empire has fallen. I'm kind of disappointed that we didn't get a little bit more from the ground invasion. But hey, we did get the pollution processor from our spy before, so perhaps I shouldn't complain too much. First time conquered. Look at this planet, hey. Everything is here. Research, research lab, biospheres, auto factory, robo miners, space academy. It's a rich planet with a space academy. Well, let's build ships here, bro. Okay, so now we have to decide where we will go next. We're at war with Trilarian. They're definitely in the lead when it comes to technology. They even out-tech the Cylon here. Yeah, look at this. Cylon are the green line. And the Trilarian the orange ones. So they're doing better than the Cylon. Fleet, that's me, by far. Buildings is me, look at this straight up line. <laughs> Going good. Population, I'm doing well, of course. Uh, the sign on our uh, the version without low G penalty here, and they have a spy bonus. While the Trilerian, who are also creative, they are aquatic and rich homeworld and transdimensional. I would say this is the better race, actually. I would rather play this race than the Cylon race without low G. So what should we do? Should we attack the Mershan? Take these worlds here. Roshan are closest by, of course. For, to get at the Trilarian, we need to fly all the way back up. We have a huge fleet with some redundant uh, ships, but we still have plus uh, 17 command uh, rating. So we can just keep building ships. Oh, we are so happy on food now. All the simulator has finished. Look at that effect.
some uh, micromanagement here. Let's bring our fleet to uh, Tatiana. And then we have the Dauntless guidance system as well. I, sh I should have researched that maybe earlier, but okay, we'll have it now. Dauntless guidance system automatically installed once the technology is researched. That's an achievement. In the research lab, we had it already. New scanner. And then we can get positronic computer, so we can switch to beams. I prefer to get anti-graph first. Because why actually? I should prefer um, iridium fuel cells, in fact. It miniaturizes the Merkelite missiles further and I give can give them the fast and uh, armored mod while my range is increased as well for the fleet. So let's go for ir iridium fuel cells. Not sure if we're gonna use these ships uh, anymore, but it's just fun to redesign them. This is our carrier. No change there. This is the Corona. Here will be a big change once we uh, get Iridium fuel cells. And then there's Merc, little Merc. No change as well. So let's build a BB1. It's going to be finished in two turns. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, two turns for a battleship. So the situation has dramatically changed now because in the beginning of the game when you are tolerant, your production actually sucks. But once you get the buildings, automated factory, row of miners, the story changes completely because without pollution, you know, this production is just crazy. Look at these hammers down here. Two hundred and sixty-three industry produced. Look at the morale bonus here, forty-one from Holo Simulator. C 
six turns for iridium fuel cells. Sign our spies. So that's uh, ten for you. Ten for you. And they're not spying on me because I have nothing that they want. Unless they want to sabotage me, but that's not going to happen. They are pacifist, so that's not going to happen really soon. Nothing we can do, we're repulsive. So it's 5, 10, 10. We're gonna build an uh, outpost here on swing if uh, the Mershan will let me. And then send, send in the full fleet <laughs> and go on the offense. Look at the number of battleships we'll have in a few turns. Plenty of money to go negative on command as well. Select from that tie. Outpost in swing, yes, please. Let's see if the Mershan have radiation shield. Uh, no. no, they don't. They don't have radiation shield. So we're gonna be good. Select combat at swing. Let's continue being aggressive. One battleship from the Mershan and the Starbase. I don't even think we need the runners here. Oh, they don't have shields. They have titanium armor and no shields. Wow. It's a decent ship though uh, for uh, early game, battle scanners included with some uh, neutron blasters, but no defenses. Bomber. Well, my fleet is certainly overkill. Make sure that I um, shoot these at the starbase from a different uh, angle, so they don't all die in some gigantic explosion. Look at this battleship. I need to retreat it, actually. Yeah. <laughs> 
runners need to run. That's what I mean with a gigantic explosion. But we're still good, of course. Because we have such an overkill, we're still okay. Mind control. really fast with this battleship. Schwing just conquered. They have an atmosphere renewer. Marine holo robos. Marine robos holo. Carway stock exchange. Okay. okay, we're at war with the Mershan, our next uh, target. Uh, let's continue in the next episode. Thanks for watching. See you next time.